Hey everyone, my name's Gilberto. We're back again with another Battle Spot session. Still rocking out with this Gen 6 team. I'm real excited about it. So many mods that I have not been able to use before. But we are here. We are doing some things. And that is a scary rating. Scary as fuck rating. Uh, and we have a Tyranitar Excadrill. Uh, man, what's that called? Azumarill. Rotom Heat, Superior, and Mega Salamence. So, TBH, TBH, Tyrantrum sweeps. Except for the Superior, maybe. Does uh, man, this is something that I always forget. So forgive me for being dumb, but uh. I can never remember whether or not grass, grass is neutral, or rock is neutral against grass, or if it resists. Okay, grass, okay, rock is neutral, ground is not, okay. So yeah, Trevenant kind of sweeps, if he can, if he decides he has some eyes right now. And I kind of have to prevent a s prevent Salamence from setting up. So I might want to lead Tyrantrum? I don't know. I don't know what I want to do here. I really like Malamar too, but Rotom's going to have the Will-O-Wisp. So I'm going to have to take it out in one hit. I'm going to do Greninja. I'm going to lead Greninja, bring the Malamar, and bring the Tyrantrum. That, that seems pretty legit to me. Because I really like Malamar here. But Malamar is not going to match up well against the Rotom because I don't want to get burned. And at least Tarantrum, if he's set up enough, can outspeed and head smash him to the next dimension. And here we see Greninja and the Tyranitar, which is not good for me because of the sand. I do have the Expert Belt. Stab Super Effective Expert Belt in the sand. So, Expert Belt... So, Stab counteracts the sand. And then I have Expert Belt. So, Expert Belt... Expert Belt Super Effective. I guess. And yeah, this sand is clearly to... To destroy... Sashes, I think. Oh, it did, it did not do as much as I would like. Fire Blast. Do you think... Uh, no, I, I was going to say, maybe he thought I was going to U-turn, but why would I... Did he think I was going to Grass Knot? I don't know. I don't know. That, did, that didn't quite make sense, but it misses anyway, so whatevs. Didn't quite make sense, but oh well. And Young Gek comes through. Young Gek coming through. So, let's see. What are you going to come out with? There's the Azumarill. This is exactly the situation for which I have the gunk shot. And there's no reason not to. I'm going to do it. Let's see what you let's see what you let's see what you do. Now now he sees that I'm a mixed attacker. Oh, I just missed taking him out as he as he munches on that citrus. And I get play rough. I resist that, I think. But ooh, I was gonna say, but Greninja's paper, paper, uh, frail, and I no longer have that. And I'm a hasty nature, so I have a negative defense nature. So I thought there was a chance I would not live that at all. And I think Dark Pulse is neutral, so I'm just gonna Dark Pulse, so I don't miss. I think. Uh, what's oh Aqua Gen? Oh yeah, not bad, not bad. Oh, that does take me out. I can't. Well, I guess yeah. I, I, I guess I assumed it wasn't going to take me out because in my head I still resisted it, but I clearly don't. So that's fine, that's fine. So I'm going to break out the Malamar here, and we are going to get to plus one, plus one real quick like.
Oh wait, this is not a good idea. Well, realistically, yeah, Azumarill could have wrecked me anyway. But oh, he withdraws. Let's me get a free superpower off. Interesting. Goes into the Rotom, I imagine. Yeah, that, that's Rotom. But that's a free plus one. Plus. Oh, this is this is a max defense situation, isn't it? So I'm gonna get Will O Wisp. Which isn't the worst thing? Oh, I could facade. This is exact here. I'll, I'll, I'll just to just as a refresher. There's no reason not to facade right now. Cause I'm gonna get wisped, and that's fine. Overheat. No. You. This. This. This guy doesn't even know. Eesh, that did a lot. But I'm. I'm gonna have to do some math right now in my head. Oh no, that did more than enough. That did 120? No, that did a lot more. Oh yeah, that did a, that did 121. So if you cut that in half, it would be 60 damage. Wait, that can't be right, can it? Yeah, I guess it, So I have a chance at living this. And I'm gonna get a knockoff. Off. I'm gonna knock off. I have a chance of living this on like 10. Maybe single digits. I live on 11! Yes! So how much is this not- Oh, this knockoff takes him out! Now I get to see his item too, because I'm really curious about that. Malamar is coming through choice specs. Choice specs. And now there's not much you can do because I'm- Because Azumarill is going to be pretty slow. So I don't think you can really- I'm gonna- I'm gonna check on that. I'm gonna check on how slow Azumarill is real quick like. But I'm pretty positive that I had speed because I'm at 134 speed and I'm pretty positive. Or I should say my Tarantrum is. Because you're gonna take- you're gonna take me out with an Aqua Gen, that's cool. So yeah, uh, Gen 6 it, ma it maxes out at 112. So 100% I had speed and there is nothing this little Azumarill can do against my Dragon Zord. And there goes little Armand White. So I guess, yeah, if, if you guys didn't get the reference earlier, that's that's what, that's what the name is referencing. A film critic named Armand White, who's a contrarian on everything. <laughs> uh, it's, so here's Tyrantrum. And I'ma just, oh I should, I should have done with the Iron Head just, just for the lulls. And I do not speed. Not even gonna Aqua Jet for funsies. And we get another win. Hey, this Gen 6 team is coming through. I mean, granted, I'm using an Ubers. I'm using an Ubers. But I am using an, I, I'm using a couple NUs. I think um, I'm pretty positive Tyrantrum is NU, and I wanna say Malamar is somewhere around that, maybe hovering around RU or something like that. But in any case, thank you so much for watching. We upload Battle Spot all dang week. New teams every week. This is a new team, and then having so much fun with it. In any case, thank you so much for watching, and I am once again out.